Upon arrival in the OR, the patient is asked the first six questions on part one of the surgical safety checklist by the circulating nurse. The patient is also asked if they are wearing any dentures or if they've had any previous orthopedic operations or implants that may interfere with the surgical procedure. The nurse then introduces the rest of the surgical team. This interaction actively involves the patient in the process and gives them an opportunity to clarify anything important related to their surgery and establishes a link between the patient and the nurse, which can help reduce patient anxiety. It also allows the nurse and other OR staff present to evaluate the patient's level of consciousness and psycho-emotional state. The rest of part one is confirmed by the surgeon performing the procedure and the other OR staff according to what appears in the patient's chart. Part one of the surgical safety checklist. Good morning, sir, and what is your name? My name is Sylvie. Okay, what are we here for today? Hernia. Which side? Okay, okay, come lie down. We're gonna put you on the bed. Be careful, the side of the bed is small. You have any allergies to medication? No. Dentures, contact lenses. Have you had any operation for your bone? Or do you have a metal implants or anything? No? Only a hernia. That's it? Fine. Okay, I will leave you with anesthesia. So, and uh, my name is Sylvie. And this is Grace and Bing, who are the nursing team. And Dr. Fraser, that you saw just before. Now the patient is prepared for the actual surgery, anesthetized, instruments are ready, prepared and positioned, and the surgical site is revealed and prepared. Before any incision is made, part two of the surgical safety checklist is read out and confirmed by participating staff. Part two of the surgical safety checklist. This part should be done by the surgeon, an R5 or a fellow. Okay, this is Mr. X. We're going to be doing a hernia on the right side. ASA is one. The duration of this procedure will take about an hour. Any allergies? No. Any anesthesia concerns? No. Surgeon is Dr. Fraser, resident alchemist, scrub nurse Bing. Sylvie is the circulating nurse. Dr. Becor for anesthesia. Any anticipated blood loss? Minimal. Any complication? No. Antibiotics needed? Okay. No. Fine. Okay. Prep looks dry. Equipment is ready. We can start. As the operation is being completed, part three of the surgical safety checklist is read out before anyone leaves the OR. This step is to confirm which procedure was performed, what specimens were obtained, and in addition to verify that all equipment that was used was removed from the patient and is accounted for, and note made if there were any problems with the equipment. Any post-operative orders such as antibiotics or VTE prophylaxis are also discussed. Part three of the surgical safety checklist. Okay, so this is Mr. X. We've done a hernia on the right side. Do we have any specimen? No. Sponge count, instrument count is correct. Yeah, no equipment problem. Dr. Fraser, wound classification is one. Thank you. Need for any post-op antibiotics? No. Okay. Do we need any prophylaxis for VTE? No. Okay. Thank you. The surgery ends. The patient and the surgical team are now allowed to leave the OR.